Hi everybody, it's Wendy. Thank you for joining me today. I have some uh, an array of rainbow colors. I'm into the rainbow today. Um, I'm going to be doing two. This is an 8x24 and I also have a 12x24. Um, I've been sitting here trying to work up the, the right colors um, from a I don't know, from a, from a metallic perspective. So I have, for red, I've got naphthol deep red, and I'm going to add metallic red. For orange, I have the azo orange with a pearl tangerine orange that I'm going to add to it. Yellow, azo yellow medium with a pearl gold yellow by Arteza. I have an emerald green with an artist loft metallic green. I have my thalo blue with the Artist Loft metallic blue. And I came across uh, Lucas, Lucas Studios, and I haven't used them before, but I loved this indigo color. So, but I didn't have a metallic to go with it. So what I did was I took the indigo and I added some white, and then I added some silver. I don't know if you can see how reflective that is but that's going to be the metallic that goes with that. I did the same thing with the Liquitex Basics Deep Violet. Um, did the same thing with that. There's, maybe you can see that the shine a little better with that one. So uh, I'm going to add white to most of them as well. Um, and it's just going to be a blowout back and forth. So um, it, it, it will blend and I don't have a problem with it blending. So let's see how this turns out. As usual, I will go through, I will speed up the slow spots, put some music on, and let's have some fun. Okay, I love it. I love the way the metallics added some cells, but if you notice, these don't have as many cells because I made the metallic. It'll still shine, but I get better cells here because the metallic was a different brand than the color that I used. So I'm going to hit this one more time with a little bit of uh, uh, the torch, and then I will show you what it looks like. And then I'll show you what it looks like when it's dry. All right, let me bring it up and show you a, a little bit of the detail. Let's see if I can get some light on it there. Pretty happy with it. And now on to the 12 by 24. Thank you for joining me.